Good evening and welcome to the Gothic Bohemian Salon. I am Julifer and I'm here with a elf haul uh, and opening. I um, got this earlier today but I was getting ready to go see Dita Von Tees, and I didn't have time to stop and um, open my package so I just thought I would show you what I got and um, let's let's do it. Okay, so the first thing is this elf bronzer, which I bought because I thought it would be great for contouring. I've been looking for the proper color for my face to try as a bronzer, and the um, MAC uh, new um, bronzer from the... Um, Maleficent collection is like the perfect color, but that's like $30, and even though it's got Maleficent stuff, I just can't justify spending that much, so I'm kind of looking for something similar. So I got this um, bronzer. Um, along the same lines as that is um, this. Um, other bronzer type thing. It's a uh, it's a, it's cool a cool bronzer, and it's um, one of these neat little four color things. Um, it's got the highlight in there. I'm not sure if these colors are going to be good or not. Um, should be interesting anyway. So there was that. Um, then I got this. Um, baked eyeshadow in um, burnt plum. This looks pretty good. This is pretty great color. And that looks like it's going to be really nice. Then I got some brushes. Um, I got a couple of the e.l.f. small precision, precision brushes these here. I got a new brush which is the um, blending brush there which is kind of flat tapered pretty cool. I got another small tapered brush because I just really love this brush really really soft. It's great for applying powder because it's small enough you can get into little areas. And I got another eyeshadow C brush which is uh, you can't have too many of those. So um, then I got this zit eraser from the studio line. I've got the zip zapper but I thought I would try this because it's a little bit more sophisticated. So this is the Elf Zit Zapper, and I'll let you know how that goes. Um, and then I was running out of the Makeup Lock and Seal, so I got one of those. Okay, and then I got this lip stain in... Uh, Crimson Crush. Let's see here. Let's check out the color. Hmm. It's a little, well, it looks pretty red actually. That might work out well as a stain. Hmm. Yeah. Between the brushes. Oh, I got two makeup lock and seals. That's right. Forgot about that. Then I got the e.l.f. Um, eyebrow shapes kit, eyebrow stencil kit, and that comes in this little paper folder. So we'll just nip that off. This is little eyebrow stencils you use to, I thought that might be useful. 
And then I got two liquid eyeliners. You can't really have too many of these in black. I use them a lot, so I got two. Yeah, really can't have too many of those. Then I decided I wanted to try this new SPF 20 face primer. So that should be interesting. And I got this um, waterproof shadow liner in, I think it's champagne, no, blush. I wanted this for my waterline. That's what it looks like there. Yeah, that looks like it'll be nice. And I think it comes with a sharpener on the other side. Or, no, that's how you, oh, okay. You can twist it up. That's kind of cool. Then I got three of these HD blushes. I got it in Diva, Encore, and Superstar. So these are kind of neat. You hardly need any. They're very pigmented. And they're cream. But they're just really nice. Trying to get it out. <laughs> Doesn't want to come out. Okay. So you see they come like that. And it's a little pump. And they're really, really, really pigmented. Um, I have a couple of them. The first two they came out with. These are new colors. And I couldn't believe how little, a little goes a really long way. This is um, that one. Let's see, um, ah, so you got to be really careful because a lot can come out and you see that, okay, I've got this tiny little bit on my finger here, look how bright that is, isn't that intense, yeah, and now, and now I'm messy. Mm. Mm, mm I have nothing. Wait, I should have some tissue paper around here somewhere. Ah, here we go. Yeah, and I got another mineral eyeshadow primer. I got a mineral eyeshadow primer. And this is in blush, it says. Hmm. And this is like, this is like an eyeshadow, but you can wear it underneath other eyeshadows. And then, let's see what else. Last but not least is this Pixie Baked Eyeshadow. And there's this nice little twinkly color. And another eyeliner. Can't have too many of those. And the last thing in the bag is this e.l.f. Maximum Coverage Concealer. This is supposed to cover tattoos, even. So, we'll see about that. Let's check it out. All right. Let's see how... Hmm, wow. 
actually. Wow. Um, it did cover a tattoo. Huh. It's pretty amazing. I wonder how long that takes to... I wonder how long that lasts. Hmm. Well, that looks like a good concealer. And the color actually isn't too bad for me. See? That's what I was covering up. Cool. Well, that looks like it's going to be neat. Okay. Well, that's the e.l.f. haul unveiling. And I'm looking forward to trying these products. I will let you know what I think of them after I tried them out. Um, thank you so much for joining me in the Gothic Bohemian Salon. And remember, embrace the darkness. Good night.